introduce yourself. So what is your name and your job role? Hi, right. my name's Tom Hogben and I work on the support team. I'm currently a, a level two support consultant. So tell us a bit about yourself. What do you like to do outside the office? So outside the office, um, me and my other half have recently adopted, I say recently, um, about t a year and a half ago adopted a couple of kids. So they've sort of taken over um, everything. Um, but we live in a small holding, so we've got goats, geese, um, ducks, chickens, and a couple of peacocks. So they're around, we sort them out every day. Um, and other bits and pieces, hobbies, I've got into quilting. Absolutely love doing quilting now. Um, and yeah, holidays, usual stuff. Cinema, well excited, going to the cinema tonight. How long have you been at DC? So I've been at Dynamics Consultants now for eight and a bit years, I think. Again, kind of one of the questions before about um, going through the adoption. There was a, a year I was out on adoption leave, so it kind of confuses everything. But yes, technically, I think it was eight and a half years. What does your role involve? So, um, my role on the support desk, it's um, answering emails. Um, if customers ring up or email with queries that their system's not working or they're not sure how to do something, then that's, uh, that's the key element of my role really is helping them fix the issues that they're getting. Um, I've also, in the recent sort of months, taken on um, elements of work requests, which kind of combines, because before being on the support desk, I was working in the consultancy team. And so dealing with the work request kind of crosses over the two, um, the two jobs of consultancy and support. It's sort of dabbling in both. And so dealing with the work request is when a customer comes through with something that's not a support call, it's something to do with um, they want some new functionality um, it means that I can go back to them with an estimate um, before it gets through to being created as a job. Because once it's a job, it um, sort of gets looked into properly by the, the, the main consultants. Um, so I can kind of give a rough idea of how much things are going to cost and then the customer can decide if they want to go ahead with it rather than going down that route from the off. moments that have stood out to you? It's always actually really nice when, when a customer rings you and you can answer their question on the phone. It's not a case of, oh, I'll have to look into that and get back to you. You know the answer. That always, that's always really nice. And it's almost a bit of a surprise as well that that's kind of stuck somewhere in your head so you can answer those. What has been your favourite company social? We did a ghost tour around Southampton and that was awesome. Like learning some of the history of the Bargate and places like that. Um, and we were, we were doing it at night, we had a dinner and stuff like that. Um, yeah, that kind of thing, that was cool. Why do you think DC is a better employer compared to other places to work? The staff are fab. Absolutely love the team that we work with. Um, gladly call nigh on all of them friends. Um, and I think there's, there's a lot of support within the company. Like, I think because you're friends, it's, there's that kind of, there's that awareness around what's going on in your lives that you can kind of get missed or forgotten about. If you're just a number to, to a company, um, then they don't know what's going on with you. But because we kind of are all involved with each other, that sounds wrong. Um, because we, we kind of all know what's going on in each other's lives, it kind of brings that community around to it. Um, also love coming to the office. Um, with the last two years of COVID, um, just being at home in an office with Jerry um, has had its strains. <laughs> so.
So uh, coming coming to the office and seeing other people and sort of talking about work with other people and stuff like that. And the office is a brilliant location anyway because having Costa just down the road is dangerous. What has kept you working here at DC? Um, similar to the last question, the people, people are awesome. Um, and the, they're still learning. Like I've been here for eight, eight and a bit years and there is still, everything's changing. It changes so much. So even like from the eight years when I started um, with Business Central, I was being called NAV at the time. Uh, and how that kind of progresses and you learn the different areas of the system and it kind of, Although, like I said, love working here, by working with the software, it means that realistically, you can kind of go into any business now and know what each area is doing. And even if they're not using NAV or Business Central or anything like that, it gives you that understanding of how a business works. So, um, and to keep learning and keep advancing skills from that side of things to continue to be able to help people on support that's what i enjoy doing so if i can always just keep helping people i'm happy <laughs> <laughs>